what would I do differently? Well, I mean, the best thing I did it, that I would do the same is I went to people who were the best to learn from them. And I went to the best teachers. I took every class I could. I read the Judy Carter books. I became a sponge. So that's something I did right. What I would do differently is I think I would worry less about how this presentation goes and realize it's not how this presentation goes. It's if you give this presentation this week, you'll learn something and you'll be better tomorrow. So I think I would take things less personally when a joke doesn't work. You know, people either think it's funny or they don't. So if you take it first person, it's to them, it's like that was funny or that wasn't funny. To us, it's I am funny or I wasn't funny. So we take it personally when it might have very well just been a simple communication thing. Uh, you might have just left a word out or an element of the story out, and that's why it wasn't funny. So there are a lot of factors, but I think if I was to do it again, I, I would, uh, even though I was a glutton for stage time at the beginning, which is that, that's what I needed to be, I think I was too caught up in how it went that time. I would let go more of that and just enjoy the lessons that I learned from it. Uh, I think I would have personally invested more. Because I was taking, you know, nightlife classes and $20 classes and $60 classes. I never dreamed of investing a lot more than that. When Had I gone to Judy Carter personally for coaching earlier on or invested in, like, her boot camp, I think I would have learned a lot more faster. So I think I would have put more into education faster. Uh, the real-life experience was uh, immeasurable. But I think I would have spent more, invested more in coaching, uh, more personal coaching. Um, I had some good teachers, but I think I would have, I would have dove in more.